Greetings, Ohio Valley. This is Dan Lima with OSU Extension from Belmont County. And this is Karen Cox from WVU Extension in Ohio County. Thanks for tuning in to Extension Calling, your source for research-based information for the farm, garden, and home. Hey friends, we need your help. In order to keep this show going, we need to hear back from you. Please take some time and check out our evaluation. You can either contact us directly for a copy or you can go online to https colon forward slash forward slash bit dot ly forward slash. Here's the tricky part. Capitalize the next three words. Extension, calling, evaluation. Again, extension, calling, and evaluation all need to be capitalized. So https colon forward slash forward slash bit dot ly forward slash extension calling evaluation. Let us know if you've used any of the information you've gained from our show. Once again, you can reach us directly. You can call Karen at 304-234-3673. That's 304-234-3673. Or you can reach Dan at 740-695-1455. That's 740-695-1455. Thank you so much for your time. Hello, Karen. Hey there, Dan. It is May and spring is in effect. That's right. And with spring, you're starting to see some of the farmers markets peeping their heads out and saying, hey, do you want to sell at the farmers market this year? So we wanted to talk a little bit about how to get engaged with your local farmers market and how to maybe uh, make a little bit more money at your farmers market. That's right. And the more that there is at a farmers market, usually the better the more attended it is, obviously you have more selection. And you know, my favorite thing in the farmer's market is Karen. What's that, Dan? Strawberries. <laughs> like, They'll be coming <laughs> soon. Talk about a great way to start the farmer's market, right? Yeah. So we have some growers that with the use of season extension technology, 